What up YouTube, this is Supercharged iOS, and in this video I'm going to show you how to install Ubuntu and Android 4.2.2 onto the Matrix ARM Mini PC. Now before we get started, a couple of things you're going to need is you're going to need an OTG USB Mini to USB cable, and you're also going to need a Windows PC. You're not going to be able to use a Mac for this. And I'll also put links in the description so that you can download the Android OS 4.2.2 for this device as well as the Ubuntu version of the software to run this device. And you can choose whichever you'd like to install, but both are installed the exact same way. So it's all up to you which one you choose. The next thing you need to do is locate the burn boot switch. It'll say BOOT on the front of the device and just go ahead and flip it from the left to the right so that you can put it into burn mode and you'll be ready to burn whichever OS you choose onto the matrix. Now just connect the USB to mini USB into the OTG port of the matrix and then plug the USB in into your PC. Now you want to take the file, the zip file that you downloaded earlier. It can either be Ubuntu or Matrix TV or Android 4.2, whichever OS you want to burn onto the matrix, whichever zip file you downloaded, just go ahead and double click it. And you want to locate this one, MFG Tool 2, and double click. And then click Extract All. And then click Extract Again. Just make sure that in this blank right here, it's the exact file that you're gonna that has the either the Ubuntu, the Matrix TV, or the Android software and click extract and just wait a few seconds while it extracts all right now the files are finished extracting and once again you're gonna click on the same file you'll see this screen in front of you as soon as it's done just click on MFG tool 2 once again double click on it and this time it'll open up this and you'll see start and exit but don't click on start yet because as you'll see no device connected is what you'll see but you do have your device connected via USB to the OTG port. But now what you're going to need to do is insert the power cable also into the matrix. And you should hear a ding like that. And now you can go ahead and click on start. And this won't take very long, maybe five minutes. And I'll see you guys as soon as it's done. And this is a definitely a good message that you'll see right there when it says sending and writing root FS. That's just what you're looking for. So just be patient and it'll be done in just a couple of minutes. And there we go. That's what you'll see at the end. So the next step is you want to first unplug the power cable from the back. And then unplug the USB port. Now you want to locate the boot switch once again, which is in the front of the device, and you want to switch it back from burn mode into boot mode. So you want to flip the switch from the right to the left. Now just connect your HDMI cord to the back of your display and into the back of the matrix and connect your power cable. You'll see the blue light. And in a couple of seconds, you'll hear the fan or you'll, you can, it takes about five seconds. And there you go. So just wait a few more seconds. And there we go. Ubuntu running on the Matrix ARM Mini PC. And as we mentioned earlier, this will also work for Android and any other operating systems that may become available to run on the Matrix also. If you're interested in purchasing the Matrix ARM Mini PC, There'll be a link in the description just below this video. All right, this is Supercharged iOS. This video showed you how to install different operating systems onto the Matrix ARM Mini PC. Hope you guys found this video pretty helpful. If you did, please click the like button. Also like my page at facebook.com forward slash charged iOS. Follow me at twitter.com forward slash charged iOS. And also check out my blog at supercharged iOS.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace.